The championship is absolutely mental. As of today, only three points separate 16th place and 5th place in the league table. Today we are heading to Reading versus Swansea. 5.15 kickoff, 16th versus 15th. If that game were to end in a draw and Birmingham City were to beat Burnley, Birmingham will go from 16th place to 5th place. Crazy. Today's game between Reading and Swansea is absolutely huge for both sides. With only goal difference separating the two sides, they both sit on the same amount of points with the same amount of games played. Who will prevail and push far, far up the championship table? Will it end in a draw between two battling sides? Today could be an absolute cracker. Let's head to Reading and find out. The game has been suspended temporarily. Um, 
I'm not going to film it because obviously it's all I have to do. But uh, something has happened in the away end. I don't know. I can't see why there's a lot of stewards. Um, everything is a health incident, so you know, hopefully it's all okay. But um, yeah, that's all the update I've got on the vlog right now. But hopefully it's all okay. I don't know what's going on. The stewards are walking away now. The players back on the pitch. I have no idea what's going on. But hopefully everything's okay. Half time, Reading won, Swansea now. It seems like the medical emergency is all sorted and is all okay. So fingers crossed that that is the case. First half was pretty decent to be fair. Um, I don't know how there hasn't been more goals. I think Swansea have had plenty of chances to do so. Especially the chance that was fired close to the keeper. Uh, it looked like a good save uh, in full speed, but I've watched it back, it was kind of straight at the keeper. But that was their best chance, I'd say. Redden should be tuning up. The penalty was absolutely abysmal. He sent the keeper the wrong way, but fired it over. Uh, to, which was met by Swansea fans chanting, Harry Kane. So, uh, there you go. It, a weird half of football with everything that went on. Uh, but, decent nonetheless and it, it, it's set up for a decent second half to be fair Swansea looking to try and find an equaliser and I think they, they have a good chance of doing so we'll have to wait and see but yeah let's go to the second half
Right then, full time, Reading 2, Swansea 1. What a game it was. It was very, very cagey towards the end. Some serious challenges being put in. A fair few bookings, a lot of fouls. But it was a very even game. Some tension towards the end as well when their keeper came up for that final set piece and almost ended up conceding. But the attack didn't come to anything. Yeah, um, I think Swansea might have, you could say a bit, were a bit hard done by, but at the end of the day, they didn't take their chances. I think even for the goal, a very good save was forced and they just about managed to tap it in, but it just wasn't really Swansea's day, and I think that was clear to see. But huge, huge three points for Reading in their season. That pushes them right up to where they want to be in the table. And yeah, what a game. I'm glad I came to it. It's another ground ticked off the list. It's number 31 out of the 92 for me. And yeah. What a day, and thank you to the Reading fans that we spoke to for being so hospitable. They're all legends. Top fan base, fair play. If you did enjoy, please do smash like and subscribe. Help me on the road to 2,000 subscribers. I know. Uh, have a class for today, and I'll see you for Shrewsbury Way.